Hello, in this session we will discuss a question on angle between two polar curves. So this is the question. It says we have to find the angle of intersection of two curves and the curves are r equal to a log theta r equal to a by log theta. So basically this is r equal to f1 theta and this is r equal to f2 theta. From here, like we have discussed, we'll start with taking log on both the sides and then differentiating it with respect to theta. So we'll have log of r equal to log of a plus log of log theta since like we can just use the product rule for the log. So log of a times of log theta will become log a plus log of log theta. Similarly, on the other side, we'll have log r equal to log a minus log of theta. Since we have got log theta in the denominator. So division log of log theta. Now we'll be differentiating with respect to theta. So we'll have 1 by r dr t theta equal to log a will be a constant so 0 plus 1 by log theta times of 1 by theta that is chain rule and this side also 1 by r dr by d theta equal to log a constant so minus 1 by log theta 1 by theta. Now we can see these are the values which can be said like it is actually cot phi 1 equal to 1 by theta times of log theta and this is also cot phi 2 equal to minus of 1 by theta 1 by log theta. Reason being we know that the expression for, I'll just write it somewhere, tan of phi is actually given as r times of dr by d theta. So now you can see that we couldn't get cot phi 1 or cot phi 2 as cot of something so that we could have explicitly got phi 1 and phi 2 here. So in that case, we'll have to proceed further to find the point of intersection also like we have already discussed. So first of all, this is tan of phi 1 like after reciprocaling we will get theta log theta and from this side it will be tan of phi 2 as minus of theta log theta. So we need to find what is this theta then we will be in a position to solve for tan of phi 2 minus phi 1. Now let's get back to the polar curve. One of the curve is r equal to a log theta. The other one is r equal to a by log theta. So from here, when there will be intersection of the curves, we'll have same point satisfying both the equation. So let's say this is r and this is r, another one, equal to f1 theta, this is equal to f2 theta. So in that case, we should look for the point of intersection. So that means f1 theta should be equal to f2 theta. And that is a log theta equal to a by log theta. So that gives log theta square equal to just a because a by just 1 a by a. So that is 1. So from here we can say that this is possible if like log theta is 1 and then theta should be simply e. For e theta equal to e will have log of that value to be 1. With this we know that as we are looking for tan of phi 2 minus phi 1, considering this, this to be an acute angle, this is something which will be equal to tan of phi 2 minus tan of phi 1 by 1 plus tan phi 1 tan phi 2. This is what we'll have. Now, since theta is e and log theta is 1, 
we have already found the values of tan phi 1 and tan phi 2 so just putting this values we'll have this as minus theta log theta minus theta log theta again by 1 minus theta log theta square this is what we will have so this is going to be minus 2 theta log theta by 1 minus theta log theta square now theta is e so minus 2 e log theta is 1 so just 1 by 1 minus theta that is e log theta which is 1 so e square so that means we are getting minus 2 e 1 minus e square as tan of phi 2 minus phi 1 now since this value is coming out to be let's say negative so in that case from here we'll have phi 2 minus phi 1 as tan inverse of minus 2 e 1 minus e square so we just have to make sure that the value should be positive and the angle here is actually acute angle therefore angle of intersection which will be phi 2 minus phi 1 and we can say that the mod value considering the angle to be acute this should be tan inverse of minus 2 e by 1 minus e square and as we know that tan of 2x is 2 tan x by 1 minus tan square x so we can say that this expression will actually be tan inverse of minus 2 tan let's say x by 1 minus tan square x where tan x can be considered to be e therefore phi 2 minus phi 1 will be tan inverse of tan of 2x I'm considering the value to be positive here so we are taking out the absolute value and this will be simply 2x and x is actually tan inverse of e so this becomes 2 tan inverse of e hence the angle of intersection is actually 2 tan inverse e so this is what we were looking for thank you